Hello everyone, welcome back to Indiana Kayak Fishing Journal. I hope you guys had a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Um, for Christmas Eve, I actually got a chance to get out and do some fishing on a Lake Michigan tributary for about four hours. Um, my plan was I was going to do some trolling for steelhead with maglips, um, and then like kind of as a backup plan, I took a lightweight rod and some little Cleo spoons, and I was going to try casting those for coho salmon if the steelhead thing wasn't happening. So. Like I said, I got out for about four hours. The weather was just absolutely beautiful. Um, the interesting thing, though, on the way to the lake was um, I drove through a bunch of actual freezing fog. So it was about 29 degrees out, and it was really, really foggy. And there was actually ice that was forming all over on the front of my truck as I was driving through it. Uh, my antenna, I thought, was just going to break off at a certain point. It had like half an inch of ice on the front edge of it all the way from the top to the bottom. And then all of a sudden the stuff the ice at the bottom of it started to break off and fall away so then all of a sudden it had like basically it was really top heavy and it had a bunch of ice on the ball and it just started going crazy and i thought it was just going to tear itself apart um pretty crazy drive to the lake uh, but after that the the weather really got nice you know the the cloud cover burned off the fog burned off it was just an absolutely beautiful day like I said, I tried trolling for steelhead for a little while, about an hour, um, without any results. So um, I switched over and started casting for cohos with those little Cleo spoons and just started absolutely hammering them. The cohos are in so thick, it was just incredible. Um, lots of small fish, so I edited out a bunch of the small fish, but I'm going to show you a bunch of the, the bigger, decent-sized fish that I did catch. Um, I ended up with a nice limit of five fish between 14 and 16 inches. Um, so some pretty good fish in there mixed in. Um... <laughs> but like I said, the steelhead thing really just didn't happen, but the coho is more than made up for it. Just an excellent trip. Um, so I hope you guys got out and enjoyed the nice weather while I was here. It seems like um, winter's more, you know, back a little bit more now, um, but it does still look like there's some nice days to be had um, here and there in the forecast. So like I said, I hope you guys are getting out and enjoy the beautiful weather, and welcome to 2020. better one. Better than the last one. Another go. -o. Easy, easy. 
Dose. Oh my god. Oh, these things are nuts. Oh my god. Later. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. No, they're still in there, boys. Jeez. This one feels really good. <laughs> 